Disclaimer, this video is not for you if you're working with all those oil company. Total, Ajib, Belema Oil, Slum Bejel, Natural Oil and Gas and all those oil companies where they pay you guys 900k plus. You think I don't know? I know. This video is also not for you if you are comfortable with your current financial status quo. <laughs> Welcome once again to my YouTube channel. I am super duper excited to have you all here. My name is Victoria and if this is your first time, make sure to subscribe. Subscribing is absolutely free. And of course, when you subscribe, you get notified of all the videos I'll be posting. So subscribe. Okay. <laughs> anyway, today on the channel, I'm going to be talking about side hustles. Yes. And I'm going to be sharing with you guys five legit side hustles that will definitely get you, you know, making the money back in 2020. You know, whenever I come online, especially on WhatsApp anyway, I see a lot of my friends that complain about, you know, how much they're paying them in their office and how much they have always wanted to have a side hustle. Trust me, side hustles are very, very important because no matter how much you are earning, when you have a side hustle, you can always save money towards a future project while your side hustle helps you. Now, to tell you for a fact, I've been doing side hustles ever since I finished my secondary school legit in fact i thought that i've been doing it while i was in the university my younger sister pamela had to tell me babe you have been doing this thing ever since you finished secondary school i juggle between you know going to school and doing one of the things and helping myself basically because i'm not all that very dependent i kind of like want to depend on somebody kind of stuff it makes me feel somehow so i've always want to you know look out for side hustles that can help me and so i thought to share with you guys five side hustles that will make you use the hashtag the money 2020 join me hustle number one drop shipping guys let me tell you if you do not know about drop shipping or you haven't heard about drop shipping you are definitely on a long run because have you ever asked yourself how is it that all those my hair vendors are actually cashing out every now and then is it that they have all those stocks in their office and are looking for people to buy them ladies and gentlemen that is a very big lie when it comes to drop shipping you don't need to have the things that you want to sell to people in your store you don't need to stock stuffs in your store now all you have to do is very simple what are those things that people would like to buy probably girls want to buy hair if hair is too common jewelry t-shirt makeup um gift items or whatever now once you've found out okay these are this is like the merchandise i want to be into then you look for a wholesaler that is into that merchandise and then you tell him oga wholesaler i am going to be using your product on my online store i'm going to be using pictures of your product on my online store now when people order for the stocks on my online store i will tell you and then you give it to me to give to them or you ship it directly to them now, once you've discussed these things with him, you set up your online store. Now, you can set up your online store on Jumia. You can set up your online store on Shopify. Just to mention, but if you, there are several apps, uh, you know, that can help you with your online store. I'm definitely going to link, you know, links to those apps down below. Now, after you have set up your online store, then you begin aggressive marketing. If it's Facebook, pay for Facebook ads, Instagram ads, you know, let it be written there that, oh, I have t-shirts, I have this, I have that, I have that for sale and the rest of them. This is the merchandise I'm into, I'm into this and that and that. You do this on your Facebook, you do this on your WhatsApp, you do this on Instagram, everywhere and begin to market. Once people are interested, ladies and gentlemen, that is the only time that you get to tell the wholesaler that, see, guy, people want this stuff and now once it gives you that stuff you transfer it directly to them now trust me drop shipping is so sweet because number one you don't need any capital for drop shipping the only money you need is money for data and of course if you want to run sponsored ads on facebook and instagram money for sponsored ads you don't need to get five hundred thousand naira to start you know getting goods and storing them somewhere when you're done getting goods you will not go and invest into having a store you put out my one when it comes to drop shipping you don't need all of that ladies and gentlemen you don't need all of that so it's very simple it's very efficient it's something that anyone can do because it's an app on your phone you know when when customers um order via your website or via you know your online store you receive the notification simply forward all their details to the wholesaler including your profit and then he sends it to them and give you your money that is all about 
Now, the good thing is that the internet has made it very, very easy for us to source wholesalers that will drop ship to us. Trust me. Now, if you go on AliExpress, you see different products, different wholesalers, you know, that are into drop shipping. They can actually drop ship their products. If you go on um, Shopify, there's this app, Obelo, I think. Yeah, Obelo by Shopify. Yes. Using Obelo by Shopify, you can look out for wholesalers that are into the, you know, the merchandise. You can even look out for different, you know, merchandise, different products they can actually sell to people. And once you do that, bam, you drop ship and that's it. Your money is rolling. Yeah, rolling. <laughs> Hustle number two, teaching people the skills that you have. Now, the good thing about teaching people the skills that you have is that you don't need a physical store or using your house to teach people the skills that you have internet has made it possible for you to run online courses for people now ask yourself what is that thing that i know do you know excel personally if you know excel come and meet me i want to learn you know other things in excel and i'm willing to pay if you know excel you can teach other people you can open a whatsapp class a whatsapp group or an, a telegram group and teach people do you know how to make soap a freshness uh, you know bleach and the rest of them you can teach people do you know how to bake you can teach people online and make money the truth is that people will pay people want to learn about you know makeup and stuffs people want to learn about event management people want to learn about vendor outsourcing there are different things that people want to learn about that you can actually teach them now if you do not have any skill it is possible for you to go online and learn these things and teach other people now trust me there's this girl hmm? her name is owana she's the owner of owana's beauty she's actually my friend now this girl did not pay anybody 120,000 to go and learn makeup she learned makeup on youtube and attended whatsapp online classes trust me this babe is making good money like she literally has jobs every single weekend and not only does she have job every single weekend she runs online classes to teach others what she learned for free on YouTube. So you can go, there's no excuse. You can actually go and learn things online and teach others too. People will pay. People will pay and you'll be cashing out. Trust me. Hustle number three, social media management. Now you can agree with me that Facebook has about 2.2 billion users. Now I don't even know how many Instagram has and the rate at which you spend their time on social media is alarming. Now what if you had a job whereby you could you know convert your use of social media into something profitable that can give you money. Now instead of spending your data on something that does not give you money, why not go and manage people's social media handles? Now there are people that are very, very, very busy, that have online stores or probably a page on WhatsApp or on Instagram. They don't have the time to start developing content. They don't have the time to start, you know, writing out content to people, telling people buy this, buy that. They don't even have the time for product photography. Do you know you can tell them that, okay, I'm into social media management, you know, come and use my services. I, 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 I help people. You know, manage your social media pages and they will pay you each page you manage for a month is 19 to 20k and nobody told you that you can actually manage just one page you can get to manage two pages or three pages depending on your schedule and before you know it you're already cashing out turn your social media love or your love for social media into something that is profitable into something that can give you money this also number four yes event planning and management now um i know that you've heard about event planning and management before and there are a lot of event planners out there now do you know that um um there are events every saturday virtually every saturday there's always an event and some people are so busy like they're working in a very very stressful eight to five or a very very stressful you know nine to six or whatever and they cannot really plan their weddings they cannot have time to start running out and sourcing for vendors now if you have an eye for coordination this is one job that will get you having money now aside getting your you know your event management fee or stuff do you know that for each vendor you get you can add money on top of each of them. Like if somebody comes to me and say, ah, eh, yes, yeah, so please give me my vendor. So Ketra, I say, Ketra, how much do they charge? 100 naira. Okay, for that 100 naira, where do they charge? You go add 20 naira. So that 20 naira, nine before me and stuff like that. So 20 times about 100, you know, plates of food and whatever is your money. So you not only get your event management fee, you are getting 
fees forever. Now those people ask me, ah, I'm not, I'm not good with event management. Go online. That's why we have online courses. Go and learn the art of event management and how to, of course, you know, get people for a start. Now, once you're done with that, you can open an Instagram page and start telling people, oh, I'm doing event management. If you're looking for your first client, are you not married? Are you not married? You use your pictures and posts. That's wow, beautiful event planned by whatever. Is your friend not married? Tell them, babe, I beg, borrow me that your picture where you use pose. Make I put that for my event management page. Before you know, people are like, ah, this guy is to get me friend, though, and you're growing, and you're growing, and you're growing. Just like that, before you know, you're already making the bag because event management is making weight. Now, talk about that. Okay, fine, I don't really want to be into event management. You can be an event coordinator. Trust me, some planners used to have three jobs in one Saturday. They need people that can go and coordinate those jobs for them. That can be your work. You can just go and meet the planner and tell the planner, ah, good afternoon, ma, please, um, I have an eye for event, blah, blah. Please, can I help to, you know, coordinate your event and stuff? Can I be a part of your team? And stuff like that. For every Saturday, you get between 8 to 10K to coordinate their event. Now, if it's, you know, you know, you know, four Saturdays, you have four events to coordinate for four Saturdays. That's how much? 40K. <laughs> how much do you want to aim? How much do you want to aim? 40K is something and it can actually help you every month. Why not try out event planning and management? Hustle number five, connecting properties to clients for either buying or renting. Now, I know a lot of people will be like, oh, is it that kind of agent thing? Yes, it's agent thing. Now, have you ever asked yourself if there are ways where you can rebrand the whole agents are there into something that will be very nice and very good. Now, trust me, people are always looking for houses either to buy or to, you know, rent out or to lease and whatever. Now, have you ever asked yourself if there was a way you could, you know, have some sort of like group or an app or whatever that connects property buyers to sellers? Have you asked yourself? You can actually be the first person to do that. The second, the third, the fourth or whatever. Rebrand the whole agent idea and you could be making cash. Now, say for instance, someone comes on your handle, your page, or your app, or whatever, and says, oh, I'm looking for a two-bedroom flat. That person is going to pay you commission for the two-bedroom flat. And whoever gives the person the two-bedroom flat is also going to pay you because you are the agent. Now, each agent gets between 10 to 40K um, um, per house. Now, if you outsource five houses, you understand, in one month, and it's 40K you're getting, 40 times 5 is how much? Do the mathematics you can actually rebrand the whole agent idea and begin to make money now all of this i've actually shared do not need you having a physical store or whatever you can start now to do it so guys we have finally come to the end of this particular video thank you so much for watching up until this time if you haven't watched my previous videos make sure you watch them i have interesting content out there for you to watch thank you so very much because i already know you're going to watch it and at this point i'm going to say a huge bye to you and see you same time next time